Hello everybody and welcome back to Traveler's Rest. So let's go ahead and open our tavern. Before opening your tavern, consider stocking up for the day. You'll need more logs for crafting in the fireplace. Visit the post box outside your tavern and order more supplies. Okay, let's go ahead and do that then. Oh, and I apparently missed some spots from cleaning. So let's, let's get some supplies going. Brewing, let's just have a look. Empty keg, wine yeast, every bottle, mm, food. Every five days, five random ingredients will be available to order, marked with a star. Some ingredients can be farmed after unlocking them in the farming tech tree. Okay. So let's just spend some time gathering some stuff before we open. Let's have a look up here. Oh, it's just uh, nothing. I guess I have to build onto the tavern to get like actual rooms where people could stay. We've still got some porridge, so I think we'll go ahead and open for the day. Okay, and we've still got some beer. So let's go ahead and open, and we'll see if we can finish off that quest to serve the rest of the porridge. Oh, here we go. We've got some porridge orders. There we go, and we've done that. Okay, let's have a look at our quests and see what's going on. Okay, our next quest is we got to mine some metals, so I think we'll go do that. We opened for breakfast. We're closed. Oh, we should. Let's go ahead and tidy these. So let's go and get some metals. Oh, we've also got a rug. We'll put that down in a minute. I know there was a big vein down here. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, so we've got a few things from that, we should go place them down. You've obtained the smelter and the anvil. When you build the smelter, a new working area dedicated to metals will be created. This area cannot overlap with any other working area. Some objects can only be placed in certain working areas. The anvil can only be placed in the metal area. Okay, I like that. Let's just get this one while we're down here too. And then we'll go and set up our metalworking area. So here we go. I've placed down the smelter. So let's go ahead and... Not enough fuel. Okay, so I need firewood. Okay. Okay, so that's doing some firework for us. Let's come firework some firewood for us. Hmm. Let's just make some of these. Because I think it's just handy to make everything that we can. I'm also going to chop down this tree. 
Okay. Okay, so I've gotten some firewood. So I think. Hang on. Eh? The fuel. Let's just throw some firewood in there. Let's open. Let's get some iron going and let's not enough fuel for our copper. Okay, let's open, let's get some more fuel. We'll add that in there too. Okay. There we go. Let's craft some more firewood. Let's open this. Mm, let's have a look and see if we've got any quests going at the moment. We need to make nails. So this should be done. Let's collect that. Now let's open this. Nails. Not enough fuel. Okay, so we need to fuel this. Let's get our nails going. Let's get two of them. So we're getting some points towards our skill trees too. This is great. Oh, this is done. And we've done that quest, so we get a workbench. Great. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and place this down. It needs to be placed inside this area. So let's go ahead and place it up here. And let's have a look what we can do. Wooden jug, some tables, a chest. Small table, small wooden window. Birdhouse, aging shelf, empty kegs, mm, okay, a few different things. Does this mean I need it for a quest? Let's have a look at our next quest then. Quest, quest, quest. More tables, craft a small table using the workbench. And then we get paper coasters, ooh. Um, so what do I need for a small table? Wooden planks and iron nails. Oh, hang on, there's not enough fuel in this, so let's go. Add the fuel. Okay, so what I need to do is I really need to go and chop down some more wood. Okay, so we are now crafting our small table. Um, okay, our table's done. We've got our rewards. We've done that quest. Uh, we've got some new quests available. You can now unlock your... Okay, let's go unlock our crafting room. Oh, we're too... We can't afford the crafting room. Mm. Let's open up for a little bit. So everyone's gotta get out before three. 
and snooze. Not a bad second day. I am just kind of learning as I go along, so I'm sure we'll get better. I've got some decorations. Oh, we've got a cat. Oh. Oh no, how will it, oh god, oh my gosh, I can't choose. Oh, this looks like my cat. This, this looks like my cat, Leo. But then this looks like my cat, Evie. Uh, they don't have one that looks like Booker, who's sleeping next to me at the moment. Um. So I think I'll go Leo, uh, because I miss Leo. Hello. I love you. Paper coasters. I can change the style of these. Oh, I like. We'll keep them square because then I don't want to change the rest of them because I am lazy. Okay, so let me get out of decoration mode. What can I I can pet the cat? Uh, a cat has wandered into your tavern. I guess it lives here now. You can buy a bed and a water bowl to keep it happy. Oh my god. Okay, so I've just pretty much had the tavern open all day, but I finally got enough money to unlock the craft room. So let's go ahead and have a look. Unlock crafting room, found in the north of the tavern. I got some barley and a bucket of water. Okay. This is your crafting room. Let's make some porridge. Okay, great. I've run out of porridge, so that will be great. So let's load this up. I only got this for fuel, but that'll be alright. Okay, let's go ahead and make porridge. Some recipes can be modified. This allows extra ingredients to be added. Some recipes have mandatory modifiers. Okay. Porridge requires grain. Try dragging the barley from your inventory into the slots. This will create barley porridge. Okay. Wait for your porridge to cook. Okay, we've got our porridge and we've now got a malting machine. Now let's brew some beer, place the malting machine from your inventory and start crafting malted barley. Remember to enter decoration mode. Okay. Let's go and put this over here. Okay, let's get rid of that. Oh, everything needs fuel. One... One second. Okay. Okay, so I've just gone and got some fuel, so we can now put this into our molting machine. And let's go ahead and make some malted barley. Molting takes a while, you can reopen your tavern and serve porridge while you wait. Okay, so I think this is where we'll leave it for now. I've got a couple other things that I need to do today, uh, so I don't have a lot of time to record. But I hope you've enjoyed this episode. As always, I'm Mallow.